Hello and welcome back to Army Men Surge's Heroes. This is the third level, the bathroom stage. There is a fair bit of platforming you have to do. And a tan soldier right here. I'm just continuing exactly where I left off. Again, I love this song. <laughs> I don't know exactly what it is that I like about it so much. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> That was actually kind of scary because um, if you fall in the water, you just die. I'm being sniped. I don't know from where. Oh, well. <laughs> That's okay. You know, this is a pretty short level anyways. And the problem was I just wasn't careful enough. <laughs> So, he's being very kind and only shooting like once every 10 seconds. Actually, where's that sniper? Let's take him out. He's the one that was giving me trouble last time. Okay. Oh, actually, maybe I'll include the next level. I feel like I should have just done this level <laughs> last time. This level is really short. But oh well. Probably just do the next level in addition to this one. Oh, unless I'm gonna run into the. <laughs> run right into the water like that. This might take a little bit longer than I thought. No checkpoints in this game. <laughs> so if you die, you die. That's it. <laughs> you gotta redo the whole thing. This is one of those sissy games with their auto saves and their save states or whatever. You can't just save whenever you want and replay some difficult part over and over again. Okay. Let's, uh, let's not do that Sarge thank you nope I'm I don't want to no <laughs> I don't know why he's doing this stop I'm just trying to strafe Good to go. there we go okay let's not strafe too much though and <laughs> run back into the water again this guy doesn't actually seem to know we're here there we go uh, also if you didn't notice there's 3do stuff everywhere where the hell am I being shot from oh god There's a flamethrower over there, but I don't think I'm going to risk my life for that flamethrower. It's just not worth <laughs> the clunky platforming. <laughs> well, actually, pretty low on ammo. Good to go. There we go. Just run and gun. Okay, so I gotta escort him now. Uh, and the music went away. Nice. My favorite song in the game just cut out. <laughs> I don't know, is it supposed to be doing that? It's just because my cartridge is so old and this game is old. <laughs> this should be like the most tense part of the level, you would assume, but the, uh, the music just died. It made it a lot less tense. Oh yeah, piece of cake. You just run, run and gun through this whole part, really. Mr. Suds. Now we can get up here. Well, that was easy. Well, since that level is so short, I'll just go on to the next one. <laughs> it only took me two minutes. Well, I guess I did die. just happened. I think the game froze. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when you play on the original hardware. Darn it. Okay, back here on the menu. All I have to do is hit load game. It should take me right back to the next level. 
which is Riff. So the objective here is to locate Riff and escort him to the helipad. Uh, okay, this is actually the level I was thinking of before that had the mines and the tank. Is that the tank shooting at me? That is the tank shooting at me. Don't know how much this wooden crate's really gonna save me from that. So we actually have to get Riff and bring him back here. So this is, yeah, I was misremembering that second level. This is the part where you have to deal with the tank. Because um, I have to come back this way later on. I think I should be okay just running up yeah, to these guys. Okay, maybe not. Well, there's a lot of health over here. And that guy's dead. And we got a heavy machine gun. Let's see if I actually deal with that tank now. I would hate to... I would hate to go all the way to the end of the level, get Riff, and then come back here and die to that tank. So it's probably best to deal with it now. What's up here? There's got to be something up here, right? Oh, maybe not. Okay, well. Comes the tank. It's not. Eh, whatever. Took a little bit of damage. Where are those mines? I know they're around here somewhere. Oh wait, I have to go this way anyways. Oh, oh no! Please stop. Let's get a better gun out. Are these the mines? These are the mines. Okay. This might actually take a little bit of time. I just picked up mines, didn't I? That looked like mines on the box. <laughs> Was I lied to? What did I pick up? <laughs> I have a mine sweeper, but it's not really gonna help me right now. Okay, well, I guess we didn't get mines. I could always try and kill with grenades. Except I can't really throw those very far at all. Hmm. Maybe the mines are further up ahead. That little alcove there on the left. Let's see, I gotta wait for the tank. So I can just maybe run by it. Okay, it's coming back this way. I think I should be okay though. As long as I keep moving, I don't think the tank's actually gonna hit me. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, it looks like there was a guy up here. Okay, he doesn't like to grab stuff when he jumps. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there's a sniper. Oh! Okay, that is not good. Let's take out the sniper first. I think I'm largely safe from that flamethrower. There we go. Where's that flamethrower guy? Oh, it's right this guy that's shooting me. Well, it's right next to me. <laughs> I tried to jump and shoot him, but that was never gonna work, so I don't know why I even bothered. Okay, he's right in front of you. Just, there we go. Uh, let's get our sniper rifle out. Is the tank gonna be able to shoot me from up here? I don't think it will. Especially if I lay down, I think I'll be okay. Am I gonna regret that though? <laughs> Am I gonna eat my own words? We'll find out. Alright, he's protected by that tree. That's great. Thank you, tree. <laughs> well, I'm clearly not shooting at the tree. Well, I guess we can take out the machine gun guy. Oh, maybe we can't. What am I even hitting? Maybe I'm hitting the ground, actually. Nope, he's still protected by the tree. Oh, maybe not. Okay. And take out this guy over here. Maybe the mines are over there. I don't know. I could probably throw grenades at the tank from up here. Actually, what's that? Ow. 
should really stop taking damage. Also, I completely forgot that that flamethrower guy was like right down there somewhere. I just kind of jumped down there very haphazardly. There he is. I think he's kind of merged with the rock. Maybe that's why he didn't come after me. Well, he's dead now. Come on, get up there. Come on. There we go. Get. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay, I'm almost dead. I gotta move. I gotta move. Okay, new plan. <laughs> new plan, I don't want to die. <laughs> so let's uh, run all the way back. <laughs> way back over here grab that health because there is a whole bunch of health way back over here. Ah jeez. I haven't even really gotten to like the level proper yet. <laughs> okay. This was oh this isn't health. These are the mines I was looking for. Oh no. <laughs> well <laughs> I suppose at the very least. Oh, there's some health. Thank you. Good to go. Um, so, is that tank going to come all the way this way? I'm not sure. Oh, now I can at least kill it. So, it was worth coming this way. He is going to come all the way this way, which means he might see me on the way back. Gotta run. Alright. Got away from him pretty easily. So, let's wait for him go past. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these things can't see you unless they're you're right in front of them. Lay a mine there and immediately die, I guess. Ah, great. <laughs> Alright. Maybe the strategy is to set the mine and walk backwards. Because if you walk forward, you'll just walk over your own mine. I don't know if I need to lay that many down, but better safe than sorry, alright? God damn it, I just got my health back up. <laughs> uh, okay, well, let's just wait behind the safety of this rock and see if our mines will actually have any effect. Uh, looks like there's more health over there that I didn't pick up earlier. It's probably safer back here anyways. Yeah, I'm definitely far away enough where the tank's not going to see me. Good to go. Come on. It doesn't seem to be working. Maybe the tanks... Actually, I placed all the mines on like one side of the road, so maybe the tank is, uh, you know, for some reason, observing the, the traffic laws. <laughs> yeah, he definitely is. Uh, okay, but, uh, absolutely nothing happened. <laughs> well, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, I feel kind of ripped off here. I don't know why the, <laughs> the mines didn't even go off. Alright, well, I'm not going to sit around and wait for that to happen again, so I guess I'll just try to run, go past the tank. It's not that difficult to get around, but I really wanted to kill it. <laughs> personal vendetta. But oh well. Don't want to spend too much time doing this level. Where's the tank? Did it already turn around? Well, maybe it did. Okay. Well. well, we're safe over here. No tanks over here. There's the guy with a shotgun. Luckily, these guys aren't really. Oh, God damn it! I keep. Oh, you know what the problem is? I'm pressing C left to try and strafe left, but I think it's C. Get up! Damn it! <laughs> Stop! No! No! Okay, can I at least hit him? Okay, let's kill this guy because he is making me nervous. There we go. I'm pressing C left, but it's C right. Is for strafing in both directions. 
<laughs> That's what's throwing me off here. Uh, what's that little thing? What did I just pick up? I have no idea. Uh, so we're going to go on top of that rock there. And there's some more ammo for us. Once again, the music just kind of died. <laughs> and now it's so eerie and quiet. And there's some health up here. I actually don't need... I want to say there's going to be another tank. Like right here. On this road. There is. Okay, let's... Uh, hmm. I think it's possible to kill this tank by shooting those barrels there, so I'm going to try that. Okay, the tank sees me, and he's shooting at me, but he can't get me through that building. Oh, he sees me again! <laughs> God, these things are pretty terrifying. Come on, come on, no! Oh, he's turning around, he's turning around! And he's going the complete like, wrong direction. Oh, great. Good thing I wasted that full health. Well, in any case, there are buildings I can hide behind, so... Uh, <laughs> maybe I don't have to deal with that tank. I could always try my mines again. And my gun's gone. Okay. Oh. All right, he's dead. I hear another tank. Where is that first tank? I really want to know before I go running around. Am I going to be safe if I just go over here and flick this switch? Pull this lever, really. I'm not really flicking a switch. To East Compound. Okay, there is a tank over there. I think I'm just gonna try and play it safe and avoid the tanks, really. It's probably the best option. Especially for beating this level quickly. There's gotta be a bazooka around here, though, somewhere. Okay, that tank. They seem to be just going around in circles. So I don't have to worry about it, like, doubling back. And shooting me. Hopefully. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't like having struggles. Oh, there's a tank right, right behind me. There we go. Like I said, when in doubt, just run and gun. <laughs> it's usually the best way to deal with these kind of situations where there's a lot of enemies around. Oh, there's two healths in here. If I can there actually get in there. A lot of health, actually. Okay, good to know. Oh, there's Riff. The bazooka guy. Oh, are you kidding me? What? What happens? Why am I dead? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, there was a, clearly a timer at the top of the screen that was counting down to when that thing was going to blow up, but it just blew up instantly. That's great. Oh, well, I guess, you know, I'm going <laughs> to do this again, like, off screen and get back to this point. <sighs> Where I was before, actually I'm not there at all yet, but I'm gonna have another go at killing this tank and see if it works. <laughs> if it doesn't, I'll just run past it again. So let's play the waiting game here. Well, the tank sees me. I kinda laid the mines a little bit more off to the side. I don't like being on the ground here. Stop, okay. Hopefully. Oh, one of them went off. One of them went off. 
the tank is not moving. Uh, oh shoot, I don't have any grenades. The tank is not moving, it's immobilized, but it can still shoot me. Where did I get those grenades? I think they were over here. Let's try and, uh... Try and grenade it, I guess. <laughs> I think these were... Yeah, these were grenades, so... Can I have my revenge? I placed another mine, like, right in front of it. Like, where that first one blew up, but... I didn't actually know it was just gonna get immobilized like this. Okay, it's probably gonna take a couple. <laughs> These are just regular hand grenades. Alright, maybe more than a couple. There we go, alright. Managed to get my revenge at last. Okay, not quite at the end yet, but I'm gonna try and take out this third tank. I didn't take out the second tank, but let's see if we can have a little bit of luck here with this one as well. And... Nope, just went right over my mines. <laughs> well, I tried at least. Okay, well we got Riff, and I'm running away as fast as I can from the bomb, because I don't want to die. I think I should be fine over here. Uh, let's get some health inside this building. I don't want to die. I actually did die <laughs> one time on the way here. Um, after I killed that tank the first time. Uh, seems like the doors have all been closed. So let's open the door. Be very careful here because I don't know if there's going to be a tank right there. Riff, get the hell out of there. If you die, I lose level. <laughs> oh, there goes the bomb. Well, luckily there is a lot of health this building, as we discovered earlier. The health does not blow up. Uh, let's see. Where the hell is that tank, though? I, I still hear it. Why did the gate have to close? It's been a lot easier if it stayed open. Oh, there's two tanks. Oh, well, there's one. Okay, let's just make a break for it. Back the way we came. I really don't want to, have to do this again. <laughs> I like this game, but oh, it's kind of slow. <laughs> okay. So all I have to do is avoid that tank. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> this is just gonna keep. No, no. Okay, it can hit me. It can hit me. Can't hit me right here though. Oh, Riff died! No! Oh no! <laughs> no, I've got to do it again. <laughs> God damn it! Okay, we're like right at the end again. Right before we get Riff, I managed to actually kill the tank that was in this uh, part of the base with a grenade launcher. I just kind of got behind it and just unloaded on it, really. So, as long as that bomb doesn't just blow up on me for no reason, I think we should be okay. Let's just kill this guy. If I can kill him, there we go. Alright, so... Uh, well... Let's get this bazooka ammo. There's actually more bazooka ammo back there. I think I'm gonna go pick that up as well. But first, I'm gonna wait for that thing to blow up. <laughs> so I don't actually. Just don't wanna take the risk, you know? <laughs> I don't wanna die and have to do this level for like a fifth time. Uh, just turning into. Very quickly turning into the world is not enough. Again, where I had to replay every level like 20 times to actually beat them. Hopefully, I won't get hurt by this thing. I did get hurt by my own grenade when I was like 20 miles away earlier. Oh, we're good. Alright, so let's go collect some bazooka ammo. There's gonna be that one tank that was... I don't know if it's always stationary, but it was stationary out there when I opened that door last time, but at least that second tank is dead. But there are probably more tanks. <clears throat> well, I know there's at least that one tank in the first part of the base, and 
I did not kill the tank on the road at the start this time because I just wanted to get back to this part. Uh, but now that I have a bazooka and uh, quite a lot of ammo, hopefully it won't be a problem. The main problem was last time Riff died, <laughs> which I don't know. I guess it wasn't entirely my fault. The tank had a a good shot through the window, that, you know, of the Quonset hut. <laughs> it happened to kill him. All right, so there's a tank here, but it doesn't actually pose any threat because it doesn't move or even aim in my direction. Uh, but let's be careful. You never know if any more tanks could have spawned. Okay, never mind. I don't hear any more. Oh. Oh no. No! Oh, oh! I just kicked my Nintendo 64 in the game froze. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh. Oh. Well. I guess I have to do it again. Alright. Once again, I've made it here. This time I killed the tank in the first uh, little section of the camp here. I did not kill the one in the second one, so I might get a very unpleasant surprise as soon as I open this door. I don't know where that second tank's gonna be! And it's gonna be right there! It's gonna be right there! Okay. Alright, well, here's the thing. We'll just uh, play it cool. We're gonna wait maybe about 30 seconds or so. And by the time I open the gate again, hopefully it'll be facing the other way and I can take out... Oh, okay, I just changed the map. I don't know how to do that. Take out that tank very easily. Alright, let's open the gate. Open the gate. Open the gate. Yes! Okay, plan worked. Alright, now I just have to be sure not to kick <laughs> the N64. I didn't really kick it, per se, but I did nudge it with my foot, because it's on the floor right below me. And it caused the game to freeze, so... Uh, on a positive note, I did... Uh, let's go back here and grab some more bazooka ammo just to be safe. So there might be another tank in that first section. Again. I did kill pretty much every tan soldier in that second part of the camp, so I shouldn't have too much difficulty just running through it. I mean, there might be a couple extra guys that spawned in. Can I get back out? Can we get back out the door? Alright. Uh, but that tank at the very beginning is still there, but... Again, with bazookas, shouldn't be too hard. I wish Riff would actually, uh, I don't know, maybe contribute a little. He does have a bazooka, but I don't think he actually shoots at anything. Ah, <laughs> oh, boy. Somebody's shooting at me. I don't know who, I don't know from where. <laughs> just gonna shoot. <laughs> as soon as I round these corners, just open fire. Oh, there's a soldier there. He might actually shoot at me. Let's get rid of him. There's some mines. Alright, let's just pop out and see what we got to work with. Looks like pretty much the same thing. Get rid of the immediate threat that is that tank. And let's get out of line of fire. Don't want Rift to be sniped. Oh no! Oh no, no, no! Come on, hit him! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Alright. Oh, man, I keep cycling over my machine gun. There we go. Alright. Uh, I've got a little bit of damage, but not enough to be too worried about. Alright. Let's... Still, I think I'm going to get some more health before I... Pop out. I think there was health in one of these... Barracks here. Oh, my hands are actually pretty sweaty. <laughs> I didn't think this game would get so intense in the third level. Ah, but I think some of the uh, some of it could be put down to me just not being very good at this game, really. If I had been more careful and taken my time with uh, some of these tanks. Uh oh, oh, there's a tank right there. Wow, okay. <laughs> I don't think it actually aimed at me, though, so let's see. I can, like, hip-fire this bazooka, but I doubt I'm gonna hit anything with it if I do that. Okay. 
Nope, it just shoots forward. So let's dispatch of that. Let's just be careful here. So there is one more tank. And we're home free. Ah, oh, yes. Thank you. The music. Actually, I didn't really take out these guys either. Only the guys, like, right here by this tower. So... Just so they don't cause me any problems. Let's take some of them out. Oh, there's the tank. There's the tank. Uh, let's get... Behind something, please. Oh, it's gonna shoot me. Riff, please don't die. Okay. God. Oh, that was so scary. I thought for sure he was done for. Okay. Whew. You know what? Let's just run. Let's just run. Let's <laughs> get to the end. <laughs> uh, I'm stuck on the tree. Get off the tree. Please. Oh, I'll change the map again. There's another tank! But it looks like it's one of those tanks that doesn't actually shoot at me. Well, that's good. At least it doesn't turn its turret aim at me. Uh, I've got kind of an uncomfortable amount of health here. But the exit is right here. Rift just got shot. I swear to god if he died. Okay. No! No! He died right at the end! <laughs> What the... <sighs> no words. <laughs> no words can describe my emotions. Oh my god. Oh, I guess I have to do it again. Alright. Once again, I'm back here with Riff. Hopefully for the last time. You know, I let my own... Hubris... Is that the right word? Get the best of me. You know, I thought that those guys <laughs> that I left alive were all uh, running to the end. Wouldn't be a threat. But, um, little did I know that right at the end, one of them would snipe Riff literally inches away from the end of the level. That was, uh, that was something else. But, while coming here, I have killed every tank, so there's no tanks that are any threat really, because those stationary tanks don't really actually do anything. I've pretty much killed everybody else. The only people that I should encounter on the way are the guys that kind of spawn in after this section of the level starts, which uh, so far doesn't really seem to be anybody. Oh, there's some somebody. Might as well kill him. Don't know if he's gonna kill Riff. I don't really remember having to escort the guys in other levels. Maybe in some levels you do, but I don't remember that always being a thing. Hopefully it's not, because this is been kind of ridiculous, <laughs> to say the least. Uh, let's just get out of here. Oh! Nope, you get away from Riff. He is very fragile. Okay, that guy's dead. Somebody else is shooting at me. I guess on the bright side, I have learned quite a lot playing this level, especially about dealing with tanks. Or how best to deal with them, I guess. They actually can't shoot you pretty much, like, at all. Um, from the sides, even. They only spot you really from the front and maybe off to the side a little bit. But outside of that, they really can't see you. I'm still going to be extra careful here because I don't know. Saying troops, that sniper that was up there in that tower right there, that's the one that killed Riff. And he's dead, so I think I should be okay. There's no more tanks. Oh, there's one more tank. But it's okay, that tank is not paying attention to anything going on around him. So there should be nothing 
<laughs> Nothing's stopping me from beating this level. <laughs> yes. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you. You know, I probably could have just, like, gone to the next one, typed in the code. But, you know, I wanted to beat it. I wanted to say that I actually beat it. Oh, I don't even know how many attempts that took. Way too many is the correct answer. But I did it. I did it. Let's watch this little cutscene here. The Green Nation will fight on to defeat Plastro and his super weapons. And there's Vicky. Oh, there's real Vicky. Ah, whatever. Okay, so yeah, Plastro's getting super weapons from the real world. That's the uh, implication here. Oh, this is the forest level. Ooh, I remember having difficulties with this one. Yep. I'm not using the rumble pack. Maybe I should. Anyways, a lot of lessons learned in that level. Already under fire. I'm not going to do this now, obviously. Um, so pretty much, I think from here on out, I'm going to be taking <laughs> everything a lot more carefully. Things seem to work out pretty well when I do that. Except when they don't. Anyways, this has been quite a ride. <laughs> Next time we'll take on this forest level. I think there's two forest levels, if I'm not mistaken, in a row. But anyways, yep, take this on. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you then.